So we're at the stage now where I've glued the pieces back that are missing. It's my least favorite part of doing any repair. And the reason is, is because you have to get everything aligned up well. Like the tusk that was broken and it's missing a piece, you have to get it just so it's right so there's not a lip when you feel it. And I do that with epoxy or with a glue that's appropriate. Sometimes a water-based glue, sometimes super glue or CNA glue. It just depends on, on the piece and how I feel about it. This piece, or the ear of the elephant, I aligned it as carefully as I could because I want to do as little as possible uh, to, to the repair. I want to make the repair as clean as I can so that I won't have a lot of work to do because when you do a lot of work to a piece, it shows. You can see it's nice and lined up well, so it's ready for the next step. And that's going to be wet sanding this epoxy filler. And for that I used a nice uh, filler called Amazing Goop, which is a good name for it because it is kind of amazing. And it dries overnight and it dries to a very hard consistency like polyester resin right here, which is really, whew, it's so, it's like glass, but that'll sand off easily with, with wet sandpaper. So this is step two.